Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to episode 10 of the Goalkeeper Career Mode on FIFA 18. And um, from where we were last, let's have a little look how we've been getting on. We played the Chelsea game, we drew 2-2. Uh, Leicester drew 0-0, uh, lost 2-0 to Everton. They've, they've been the best team we've faced this season by far. Uh, then we beat what, Arsenal 1-0. And, uh, and we beat West Ham 1-0. So we've uh, we've won two games on the bounce now going into this Manchester City game. Uh, but we have had a couple of offers because uh, our transfer request got accepted. And we had a couple of offers. So, so these are the two offers we've had. Right, so a um, couple of half decent offers. I was expecting bigger teams to be coming in for me, to be um, to be completely honest. But um, West Brom, Leicester, decent teams. They're doing well in the league. At uh, least I'm sure they are. Uh, yeah, Leicester up in fifth, West Brom in ninth. So it would be a step up. But um, I think I'm going to wait for the January transfer window and hopefully a slightly better team could come in for us. Leicester was the most appealing. Um, but you know, there, there are a, a few teams, maybe, um, you know, obviously your top, top four, things like that, but maybe an Everton, something like that, maybe Liverpool, um, cause they certainly need a keeper, but, um, yeah, we, I'm going to stay patient with this one because, uh, as you can see, we have climbed up in the league. Uh, we're on 21 points, only 16th. So we haven't necessarily moved up positionally, um, but, you know, we're, we're now well within reach of sort of top 10 and we pulled sort of five points clear of the uh, of the drop zone. So it's all t it's turning round a little bit. Um, so I don't know if there's not a chance that I think is brilliant for us to move. Maybe we'll stay with Newcastle, but but we'll see. Here we go. Big game for both teams. Man City chasing the title. Newcastle chasing safety. It's Newcastle versus Manchester City at St. James's Park. Here we go, Newcastle lineup. Sean measures in goal. Yedlin Clark with a, a rare start and Bemba and Dummett across the back. Richie, Hayden, Marino and Kennedy getting a start on the left. And uh, Perez in behind Slimani, who has uh, he's been our only real source of goals this season. And the Man City lineup, it looks very strong. Murich, don't know who that is. Danilo. Uh, Adarabio, Stones and Delph at the back, Zinchenko, Fernandinho and Diallo in the middle, Sterling, Nemecha, Nemeca and Sane up top. So they've got a new strike that we don't know nothing about. Sterling cuts inside, goes back out wide and cuts in again, he's a tricky customer. Danilo plays one into space and Bemba sweeps that up. Sterling with the throw for Man City. Well, you get the cross in. He goes back to Danilo. Oh, big challenge from Kennedy. A good challenge as well. But Fernandinho picks up on the pieces. Danilo almost looked like he tried to lob me there or something strange. Nemeca turns, tries to play Sterling in, and we come out and gather that. Marino clips a ball forward. Kennedy puts one into Slamani's feet, and that does not go far over and wide at all. Not a bad effort there. There's a little bit lax on the uh, on the commentary. Not a bad effort. Sane driving down this left wing. Cuts back inside to Diallo, but he gets it back. Defend him well from Newcastle. Fernandinho, Diallo into the feet of the new striker. He's going to get a shot here. And he bends it just over. I don't know much about this new player. Necha, Necha. Never heard of him at all. Sterling tries to beat his man. Looks like he has. Can he hold him off though? No. Danilo gets the ball and that's well in from Dummett. Dummett lays in Aosi. Aosi to drive at this Manchester City defence. Who we got? Man on the edge. Shoot. Oh, why has he passed that? It was a decent shot in the end, but the guy on the edge of the box should never have passed that. He should have hit that first time. And Man City break forward straight away. 
Through the new man, he's causing us problems already. Oh my god. Oh no! I don't believe it. We've ran too far. We should have had that. We really should have done. Manchester City on the break. Tore us apart a bit there. That ball in from the new man just tricked everyone. I thought the defender was going to get there. He kind of didn't. We'd done enough. We got an arm out. But we got back across here, look, and instead of diving towards the goal to save it, which I wanted to do, he went past it and then dived out. Ah, oh, really disappointing goal to concede there. Fabian Delph launches one forward. New man wins it. Sterling, he's going to get shot off and it's a comfortable save at the near post. Given away cheaply. Sterling pings one over the top. It's going to get to, I don't know who this is. Bemba just gets there before him. And that's going to be the half-time whistle. Not a bad half, not the worst half. A little bit disappointed with that goal we conceded. Half-time stats. Man City pretty much controlling the game. F five shots, four on target. We've had three shots, none on target. Possession, just a percent either way. Um, and passing accuracy. Man City just edged that. Let's get into the second half. Danilo runs inside. Has he got options? He has. Gundogan back to Danilo. They're just knocking it around pretty patiently. Out wide to Sane. He goes to Delph. Gets it back. Can Man City unlock this Newcastle defence? Most probably. Macheka shoots. It's deflected and that will go out for a corner. David Silva's coming on. The corner's coming in. Sané gets there. Can't get it under control though. Sané. Back out wide to Sterling. Danilo. Sterling. It's very patient stuff from Man City here. Danilo, Silva. Oh, Sané shoots. And uh, we were luckily straight behind that. Marino with a little touch out wide to Kennedy. Back inside to Marino. Aozi. Slamani. You've got to shoot. Oh, he does. Shots blocked. But Richie wins it back and Slamani shoots again. And that's, uh, that's Cherries for Murich. Sane, little ball inside. I'm going to call this, this guy Mecca. Don't know why. That's what I'm going to call him. Silva into Mecca. What can he do? He clips the ball across to Sterling. Oh, I took a step the wrong way there. But we just recovered well. It's going to be a corner to Man City. But first we've got the substitutions. Diame is going to come on. And that's Sergio Aguero coming on for Mecca. And uh, a very different prospect is Sergio Aguero. But corner to come in. Swings one. That's my ball. Lovely. Richie gets on, on top of the uh, the header. Aozi. What's he going to do? Looks like the attack's going to peter out. Richie. Aozi. Kennedy. Can ya? He can. Kennedy makes it 1-1. One, one. That's a great time to score. Man City are going to be pushing and pushing now. But a massive, massive goal for us there. Kennedy, he's looked good every time he played, but the manager just doesn't like to start him very often. I thought we'd uh, we'd done a little bit too much there. Man City got back in numbers, but that's a, that's a decent finish from Kennedy. Really decent finish. Came off the goalkeeper's knee a little bit there, but it doesn't matter. Manchester City won. Newcastle United won. Ayozi out wide to the goal scorer. Kennedy, Diame, feet. Back into Kennedy. What will he do? Has he got time? He finds Slamani and that's a massive block. Massive, massive block. That could have been a... Well, that was a huge chance to go 2-1 up in this game. Aozi plays one forward for Slamani. Tearing clear of his defender. Cuts back. Kennedy plays it to Diame. Shoots and it's a great save. Richie's there for the rebound. Can he find anyone? Shelby shoots and it's a disappointing effort. Just a matter of minutes left to go here. Manchester City are bringing it forward for what's possibly the last attack of the game. Stones just runs into Shelby 
Ayozi plays it down the left for Kennedy, and Kennedy's in acres of space here. He tries to clip one over the top to Richie. It's going to fall for the defender. I'm sure it will. And now pumped forward from Man City. Still a chance, maybe. Aguero inside. Sane, he's beating his man. Will he find the cross? Shelby comes in with a big, big tackle. And that's it. That's the last kick of the game. It's a great result for Newcastle. Late equaliser. And... Uh, and I think before the game, we would have absolutely snapped your hand off for a point there. There we go. As the achievements roll in up the top, we played a 7.6. We caught five, parried two, conceded one. Ball stripped. I think that's when a through ball is played and you sort of come out and claim it. I think we did that to Raheem Sterling once. 87% passing. Not bad at all, considering we had to uh, essentially pump the ball upfield because they were marking all our wide men. There we go, another game done. Manchester City, their title bid has been a little bit hampered there by dropping two points, in their opinion. Uh, but that point is very useful for us. It keeps us in 16th place, and, uh, and a win could take us as high as 12th. Okay, so next up, we've got Brighton and Hove Albion at home, and then we've got the transfer window. Um, so what I think we're going to do is I'll leave the video there for today, and then the next video will essentially be me playing games off camera but just going through January until we find a new club. If we don't find a new club, it's not the end of the world. Um, but the idea is if we don't find a new club, we probably won't play a game in January. Uh, I'll play them all off off camera. If we do find a club, whether it's the first day, you know, the second week, third week, uh, we will play the first game for that new club. OK, so we'll leave it there for today. Thank you very much for watching. If you're new, please subscribe to the channel. I'll, uh, I'll do my best to give you daily football uploads. And, uh, and if you enjoyed the video, drop it a like. It does help a lot. But thank you very much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next episode.